Hello everyone, and welcome back to Metro Prime Blind. In this episode, we're going to be going to the Central Dynamo. And why am I speaking like this? It's because of the music. I don't know, I just wanted to do a different intro. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're going to be going in here and seeing what this is, because there's a question mark. And now I have four energy tanks, and if it's boss, I am screwed. Okay, so, what is this thing, what have I got to do? Wait a minute, huh? What does this do? Multiple safety system malfunctions detected. Unit should be taken offline immediately. Uh, oh my jeez, what in the hell? What is this? What are these? What in the hell is this? It's an invisible thing that I cannot hit, that's for sure. Oh, actually, yeah, I can. I can just hit it like this, can't I? But, you know what? I'm gonna die. I'm actually gonna goddamn die in this episode, aren't I? Because I'm panicking and I'm not thinking straight, am I? Alright, cool. I wanna at least do something, though. Can I just hit this or anything? Anything at all? I can't even scan it or do anything, though. I am required to find it out myself. So find it out myself, I shall. Um, with the wave beam, maybe? Aha, I thought so, yeah. So I need to use the wave beam in order to hit the damn thing, right? Where are you this time, though? You're right over here. There you are. Right, yeah, yeah. Let's just keep going for this, then, shall we, eh? Because then you're gonna die, I hope. Come on, man. Do something. There we go. It's one of those drones! I hate those things! Ah, oh, man! I'm gonna have to do it bit by bit, am I? And let me guess. Oh my jeez, what? What the hell? Oh, I think I get it. What I'm supposed to do is go into this, go by, without electrifying myself, and... But I want to be sure, like, there's another door in there, isn't there? Oh yeah, they're all locked anyway, so I can't actually do anything. Alright, cool. Let's be very careful with this. Oh my jeez, I've already got hit. Let's just navigate without doing that. Let's just go through then. Doing this. Also, wow, the music. Oh, this just sounds like really cool and stuff, trying to go through an area like this. Alright, cool, so I need to go by. The orange one goes after a while, doesn't it? So I need to be a little bit quick, like this. There we go, right. Do I have a map or something? No, I don't. So I need to navigate it all myself, do I? Cool. I'm gonna go not down. <laughs> I was gonna go down to begin with, but you know what? That didn't appear to work, like, at all. That's fine by me. Oh, man. I'm virtually shaking right now, because I'm really cautious of my health. Also, that's water. If I go into that, it's gonna kill me, isn't it? No, it isn't. Do I need to vomit? Oh, I see. Okay. Um, I don't know what the heck that was all about, but never mind. Anyways, right, let's just go through a little bit more carefully. Just like this. There we go. Navigate our way all the way to the center, even though I'm nearly there at the minute. Oh my god. I can taste freedom! Even though I can't, really. This is a real shame. Um, right, so, let's see. I need to go this way, right? Oh man, this is, this is such a long way just to get to the thing, isn't it? But you know what? That's cool. I like mechanics like this. Oh boy, though. I'm glad that I somehow s figured out that I was supposed to use the wave beam. I mean, I thought it's electrical, so I'm going to have to hit it with an ele electric attack, probably. <laughs> At least that was my speculation. Anyway, let me just bomb this. Oh, I see that deactivates it, doesn't it? Like this. Right, so then. I need to go around like this, and then go up, and there we go. Right, I got it. Cool, so what does this do? What? Oh, well, yeah, cool. So I don't have to venture down each individual one, do I? Well, what did this do? Power bomb! Awesome! I could really do with something like that. While well, Liverpool might press down to release a power bomb. Oh, that's, that's how easy it can be done. Power bombs can destroy tougher materials from multiple forms. Wait a minute. Tougher materials, huh? Now, I might be able to take out Bendesium, or Bendesium, one of the two. I don't know how you pronounce it, because I'm terrible at science pronunciations and stuff. But still, yeah, because let me just go to my log but, uh, for a quick second, which isn't that one. Hold the phone. Power bomb. Here it is. Okay, let me just read all this. Samus's notes. Power bombs do not have unlimited number. Use them wisely. Yes. Because I need to restock on those. I already know this anyway. Yes! I knew it! Ha! So now I can actually go through there. That material now is no issue to me. Each power bomb expansion you find will increase the number of power bombs you can. Oh wow! So there's power bomb expansions as well. Yeah, I, I actually forgot about this. Blimineck. But still, well, at least I'm glad that I was right about that. Right. So let's see. There's a white door over here, and there's a white door over there. Which one do I want to go to first? Hmm. 
Uh, if I go into this one, it's probably going to be a save room, isn't it? Let me just try it out for a second. Um, go in here, and where's it going to take me? I knew it! Awesome, I could really freaking do this because I'm so low right now. Oh my. Okay, cool, look at that. 99. Oh my jeez. Full energy bars. I have never been so happy in my life. Oh, God. Alright, okay. <laughs> that was really weird. I I'm just happy, alright? Also, I've, I've never scanned this, like, at all. Yeah, I know what it is. You don't actually have to tell me. It's fine, yeah. They actually saved the game. Wow. I completely forgot to scan something like that, but still. So now then, this means that that material over there, I can actually get rid of with my new ability, right? And now I can access completely different areas. Cool, so it's down while I'm doing this. Wow, you don't even have to wait for it to take effect. It just does it immediately. Well, that's cool, man. That's really cool. Okay, so where's this actually going to take me? Oh my jeez, it's these things again, is it? Whoa, I virtually just avoided that one. Okay, let's go by a little bit more safely, shall we? Okay, maybe not. Unless... Hold on. Does, does a power bomb take them out in one shot? But I don't really want to waste the power bomb or anything. I, I kind of just want to get these down with my normal missiles, given the fact that I literally only have not that much uh, power bombs left, like, at all. You know, given the fact that I've just literally got the thing, and I'm already quite low as to what it is. Alright, cool, so now let's just do this. There we go. Sidestepping really does help out a lot, doesn't it? Because let me just go into my Morph Bully. I have two. I have two left. I don't want to use them at the minute, you know? Okay, can I... Um, can I actually go at this? Um, what's this for, then? This is programmed for a reason? You know what? It doesn't look like it. Um, unless maybe that's too... Hold on, is this to get on top of here? I think it is, probably. Hold on. No, it doesn't look like it. That's just me overthinking. Okay, cool. Also, I can scan one of these. Nice. Uh, cryo tank failure. Bioform life signs are at flat line. I see. Right then, so. What the hell? I was going to say, at least destroy it or something. Also, this looks like a thing that I can fall down. Do I actually want to do it, though? I kind of want to have a look through this door first to begin with. Um... What is through here? It's another one of these labs. So you know what? I am actually just going to fall down this thing and see where it takes me. Ready? Oh. <laughs> it brings me under here. Fine. Fair enough. Um, is this going to take me then to like an expansion or something? Um, what? What the heck? What is this for then? Um, is this just a shortcut? Is that right? Oh! Oh! I see. Yeah, this was just to go by without the thing shooting at me. I think. Um, unless maybe th that's what this scanning bit is for? What is this? Uh, perimeter defense turrets disabled. Y yeah, okay, I've disabled them. Um, I felt like cutting this bit out, because that would just be unnecessary of me walking around and stuff. But no, I don't think there's actually anything else to do. So, is that a thing I can fall down? I don't know, but let me just be sure. Um, is that everything in this area? It is, yeah, and that's the thing that I fell down, I think, so if I try to go back to it, it's not going to take me anywhere. I just want to be sure, though, so you know what? Let's just switch to my ice beam and have a look. <gasps> oh my jeez! Oh my god, Th those things scared the crap out of me. I don't think I was supposed to do this, but you know what? Never mind. Alright, anyway, let's just freeze you like this. Oh, come on, really? There we go, right. And now, a, a missile, maybe? No, that didn't work. Alright, let's just do each individual one like this. Maybe? Sir? There we go. Right. Alright, missile and... Oh, come on, really? Fine. Let's just get you down like this, then. Oh, yeah, I forgot you're immune. Immune, you're blimmin' vulnerable to... No, you're immune to missiles. That's what I was trying to say. Alright, cool, so... Nope, I came from... Where was it again? So I'm here, and the door is... Up there isn't it? So, if I am here, and that, that means... Yeah, I came from up here and stuff, so is there a way to get back up there? You know what? It doesn't look like it. It really doesn't look like it at all. But then again, those actual guns came out of nowhere and tried to shoot me. Um, but I can't seem to scan them or anything, so, you know what? Never mind, except I could just jump up to it normally like this. Maybe? Is that right? Oh, no, or I could just fall back down. Okay, right, so... Hmm. So I'm here. Is there anything to scan in this bit, though? Anything at all? You know what? It doesn't look like it, but I can just literally uh, venture over to it like this. So, you know what? That's nice. That's all fine and dandy, but 
What about, uh, let's see, if, if I go to here and stuff, there's a white door over there, though, that's the only thing. I kind of want to go to first, um... It's in that room, isn't it? Yeah, it's in this room over here. Right, let me just go back to this room for a quick second, because it's right above me, isn't it? Yeah. Oh my god! It's this thing again. Hello! It's been a while, hasn't it? Oh boy, and you're just gonna do this thing again, are you? Well, fine. But at least you can do this. Or missile, maybe? Or no, you could just do that. Fine. I've got how I got rid of this thing now. I think I just shot it like this, though, didn't I? Yeah, I believe so. Alright, cool. At least I know somewhat of a strategy, though. So now let's just jump out of the way, and then do this. There we go. Um, maybe a missile, though, might be better, but honestly, I think it's fine just doing it with the ice beam, because then I'm not wasting anything, given the fact that, you know, this is just normally how you defeat it. And there we go. No harm done, except for to him, unfortunately. Alright, so let's see. He came from here, didn't he? Yeah, and that is where I came from. But I really want to go up to that white door, because that has just caught my suspicions. And it seems to be all the way up there, too. The question is, how do I get up there? Um, I'm guessing then, I will probably have to go up this, maybe? Is that right? Let me just try jumping up onto this rock and see what it does. Okay, right, so it takes me to over here, right? Oh yeah, then I can use this in order to get to the thing, right? Okay, cool, and then I can use a power bomb to access this, but... Where does it take me? It seems to take me to a completely different place. I don't know if I should be going the other way, though, given the fact that, you know, this uh, goes down to... Oh, it goes down to a lower floor, actually. Hmm. Then again, I am kind of curious as to what is actually through this bit here. So I'm going to just venture through this bit, really. I mean, I don't know, it's caught my interest. Uh, and I can easily get rid of it with one of these. Just like that. There we go. Did I, do I already have my ice beam out? I think I already do. Um, that's also not used for anything at all. <gasps> the map! Good thing I came here. I got the freaking map. Oh my goodness. I could really do with the map in this area. I'm always like that, though, whenever I find a map, like, even in the dungeon. You download the map. Okay, right, cool. So then. Wow, there is actually a hell of a lot more stuff to look about in this area, isn't there? Um, let's see now, though. There's a couple of things that I actually missed in this bit. Wow. Uh, let's see, that's the ore processing, that's where I came from and stuff. Um, yeah, because that was a thing I couldn't access, isn't it? I remember that. Um, well then, so if I'm here, I appear to access uh, all the areas and stuff, but I might as well come back to those another time or so, because this elevator goes back to Talon itself. So if it comes to it, I can always just backtrack here, because there are certain places that I need the grapple beam for in order to get back to places a little bit quicker. So let's see then, I, I am here and stuff. Um, there's the elevator and stuff, this goes all the way up and then this goes all the way down here, doesn't it? Uh, that's the quarantine access that I did with all the purple stuff, okay. Right, and then that brings me down to here, this brings me down to the very bottom, which then locates me all the way to over here. Right, okay, cool. So then, hmm, I'm glad that I at least used a power bomb though in order to access this, because you know what, that helped out a ton. But, I kinda need to backtrack to where I was, so, I came from down below, didn't I? Yeah, so I just need to go back where I came from. Oh my jeez, these guys again. You know what, forget those guys, forget those guys, forget those guys, let's just run. That's the wrong way. <laughs> Oops. Oh my god, and they're just gonna hit me immediately, are you? Just get out my way, please. I've already fought you before, and now I don't need to fight you again, so just leave me be, please. Thank you. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, okay, 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 I wanna do the thing now, don't I? Get in there, Samus, quick! There we go, right, now they can no longer get me! Brilliant. That's actually quite a smart tactic, really, in order to get through it. Alright, cool. But this time, Samus, uh, turn around. Quick, turn around and turn off the thing. There we go. Right. I lost a bit of energy there. That was poorly done. But you know what? Never mind. Oh my god, you can watch them go up as well. Can I still destroy them? Is that right? 
Oh wait, thank god then, I thought then they were going to activate and try to kill me. But you know what, they didn't, so that's bad with me. Alright, cool. Anyway, enough of that, let's actually go to this area now. What? Whoa, what the heck is this? Oh my- oh no, it's the Metroids again. Oh jeez, I can tell I'm getting somewhat near the end of the game, at least I think, anyway. I must be getting somewhere near it, I don't know. Um, let's go for the red one, because that's pirate data, and it just gets everything all done. Force build, disengage, Metroid- oh no! That was not a smart idea! <laughs> that was not a smart idea at all! <laughs> Oops, I like how the one that I just think is the safest one, it isn't safe at all. What? Did I get him? Oh my jeez, oh jeez, look at this. They're actually killing them! Oh my god, that's so morbid! Okay, right, well at least I know how to slightly destroy those guys now, because I just shoot them with any of my beams that I have, don't I? Right, so, well then, uh, is there anything to scan though? Yeah, there is, but... I'm getting really bored of scanning and stuff, you know, in like these sort of areas. Oh my god, hello Metroid! I'm going to sidestep this time, and fail miserably. That was not that great at all, was it? Alright, cool, let's just try this again this time. Because now I would like to do the thing where you do that! There was only one, though! Well, that wasn't really much of a threat, was it? I had more trouble than the bloody, stupid, invisible drone thing that I couldn't see! I mean, I was trying to scan it, but it wasn't really working! So you know that's fine with me. Anyways, right, so... I'm at least going to scan one of them, just see if it's important or not, because I am kind of curious. Fungal invigoration fluid process in the buds and all. Yeah, because I think the orange ones are stuff that's just, it's optional. It's not really required, whereas the red ones are actually, you know, the ones that uh, affect stuff in the game, really. Or at least, you know, just like, unlock the main things. The orange ones are just things for you to read if you want. Hmm. Well then, can I destroy this with a missile? I can, yeah, because I learnt that when I tried to get that energy tank before. That was really annoying, that. I was like, hmm, hold on, wait, how do I get this? How do I get this? Oh yeah, I need to shoot an energy tank at it, don't I? Hmm. Well, I have like a hundred missiles and that, so I've got plenty at the minute in order to get through areas. But you know what, I'm just gonna like blow up this area and see what there is. Was that energy? Oh wait, no, that was a power bomb, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a power bomb for me to collect to make things a bit easier for me. Alright then, I need to tread very, very carefully in an area like this, because Metroids are everywhere, and that's a problem. Okay, right, so let's just see now. Can I just get you like this, though, without you even doing anything? I can, because you are just continuously getting electrified like this. And now, yeah, there we go. You didn't even get onto me that time. Well, brilliant. They're actually not really that much of a threat. Incoming scan data, huh? Spectral analysis complete. Right, so... A Talon site. Right, so where's it gonna tell me to go? Oh my god, I need to go back to the Talon overworld now, do I? Life Grove? Alright, oh yeah, this is the thing that had, like, the thing in the way that I couldn't get the past the thing and the... the thing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Although, notice... Hold on. Let me look at my, uh, log book for a second. Because if I go to the artifacts and go to, what's it, life... Oh, I've already achieved that one, haven't I? Let me just go back to my map for a second then. And I would like to go to the Telenova world, thank you. Zoom out and go to the thing that told me to go to, which is this thing over here. Life Grove. Oh yeah, so it's not really my theory at all, is it? I thought then that that would be where the Chizel artifact is. But, you know what, it doesn't appear to be like at all. Um, well then, this is dangerous. I definitely for sure cannot go into here, because this is going to tell me about intense heat radiation. So... What am I required to do in this area? Hold on. I was increased to 400% and indicated in fungal units. Alright, I see. I thought that was like going to be an important thing then, but you know what? I was wrong. Um, well. So if I'm here and stuff, maybe this means that I can't actually go through here just yet, because if I try to jump in here, it's going to burn me, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. I thought so. So, Maybe it's not quite required to go through here just yet, given the fact that it's quite a long trek and it's going to take me, um... Where's the map? Yeah, the white doors over there and stuff, it's going to take me all the way down and places and... Hmm. And it tells me to go all the way back, so maybe I'm required to get back here later. So then... I probably didn't need to come here, like, at all and stuff, given the fact that I literally just got there and it scans it, it's obviously telling me... Go back. Don't go through there. 
or was you gonna dung goof? <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay. Uh, let's just go by though without being seen. Oh yeah, it's already deactivated, isn't it? Fair enough, fine. So, everything is a-okay in order to get back. Okay, right, but... On my way back... For a start, those things are there again, which really terrifies me. Um... Is there a way to... Well, you know what, let's just take these guys out first. Just to get them all done over with, yeah? Because otherwise they're just going to annoy the hell out of me and every everybody's going to get my way and it's just gonna it's going to be the worst thing ever, isn't it? And they give me energy anyway, so it's not like I'm really missing out on anything, is it? And that guy's just not doing anything at all. Like, honestly, do something, sir. I mean, I know you're trying to make it easy for me and stuff, but don't make it too easy. I'm playing on normal difficulty mode here. Right, cool. So with all that done then, um, let me just have a look at the map. So let's see, this is the way out. This goes all the way here. This goes to the maintenance tunnel. Wait a minute, what? I don't think I've even been in like this area and stuff. Wait, where am I at? What? Okay, here's the green thing, yes. There's the thing down there. This is an area that I haven't quite got to just yet. So then... I need to somehow go over there. But you know what? Uh, just to be on the cautious side and things, and I don't really know how long this episode has gone on for. It's becoming a common thing at the minute. I'm very terrible at it, really. I reckon I'm honestly going to call off the episode right here right now. So in the next episode of Metro Prime Blind, that and there's a save room to make it convenient for me next time I record, because <laughs> I'm probably going to turn off the game in a minute, oh that's not it, um, we'll be getting out of here, because I'm not really supposed to go anywhere, or maybe even going to this, um, where is it, it's the, uh, so if I'm here and stuff, there's a, there's an elevator here which goes down to here, so maybe we'll be going to here? I don't know, we'll play it by ear on whatever I feel like, you know, in the next episode coming up. So take care guys, I hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one.